Chris, an interesting open day, quite evenly poised. How did you make of the open day of the campaign? Yeah, no, no, good. Uh, tough conditions, obviously. Um, Worcester elected to bat. Um, it was obviously quite tough bowling wise because the wind and, and stuff like that. But obviously, we were fortunate that the sessions, the rain kind of helped us. We had like a short burst, and uh, so we, I guess, we won the first bit. I think we had them forty for four. Um, which we're obviously really happy with. Not quite so happy with where it's finished up. Um, 18 for four. Um, but on, on the whole, pretty happy. Um, you know, we've got some of the, the key top order players out. So as long as we come in tomorrow, hit our areas, we should be in good position. Yeah, it's one thing I was going to come on to. Maybe a few plays and misses, a couple of drop catches. Do you felt that maybe we did let them get away a little bit in that last hour or so? Oh, look, definitely. Um, it didn't go quite as we would have wanted. Um, obviously, but can't be up and down like you know you've got to kind of be pretty level-headed so I think on the whole you know we're pleased with the four wickets and stuff it's, it is a good pitch um, definitely so yeah we've made early in road which is great but I'd be lying if I said I'm totally happy with the, yeah, the 118 for giving that over 40. And those early in roads mainly down to yourself taking three for 33 how do you feel out there personally with your own rhythm? Uh, yeah well it was hard work up into the breeze and up the hill um, so to be up to be honest I Expected to be a bit more of a holding role, um, but yeah, yeah, it's not sometimes how the game works. It, you know, it was my sort of day to pick up a few early on today, so no, really please. You also got a new partner at the other end in Buren. How do you feel that he went on debut? Yeah, you know what? Actually, I think he he didn't get any wickets, but his rhythms and his pace and his energy obviously look, look great. I thought so. Um, he's you know he's a top guy, loves bowling, he's got skills and stuff, so it's going to be a really good signing for us, I think. And just finally, we mentioned uh, that likes of Ed Barnard and Dolivier are getting a bit fluent out there. How important is it that we strike early tomorrow morning? Yeah, I mean, early wickets is always, always good, but you, you want to start sessions the right way. So um, they're both good players, you know, they're experienced players now. So, yeah, they've obviously got a little partnership going. I'm not quite sure exactly what it is, but obviously early in roads will be great. We'll try and get the bowlers in as quickly as we can.